Elvis is in the building. Elvis is in the building. It's on the air, that bit. Oh, no, I'm, right, I'm right here. I'm right here. Good well, Elvis, it's good to see you. I know that this afternoon you were caught on the Westway. And I was. <laughs> what <laughs> were you doing? Were you, the best of times. <laughs> were you driving or was somebody driving? No, heaven has no steam and I was being driven. I was very much the way when you're Elvis. Very rarely do your own driving except in weird movies about stock cars. <laughs> That's the only time you do your own driving. <laughs> yeah, unlikely movies about stock yeah, cars. Unlikely movies about stock cars, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I know that you get stopped all the time for selfies now. Uh-huh. A lot of people want selfies with you, they right? They do, yeah. So yeah. <laughs> it's become the bane of my existence <laughs> as the selfie. I'm glad you got the guitar with you. I you, have. Yeah, mm-hmm. There it is. Oh. Uh-huh. Okay, now, can we take some calls first? Yeah, take some calls well, first. It's going to be Paul Penny. Is that you, Paul? It is indeed. Are you in Bournemouth? I am, Bournemouth Dorset. Oh, that's nice. And whereabouts in Bournemouth are you? Are you at the top of the cliffs there? I am indeed, at the top of the cliffs in a place called Charminster. I like that. So what can you see from where you're standing now? Can you see anything? A man in a great big white van, Steve. He's parked right outside my office. <laughs> OK, OK. All right, now, look, Elvis is here. Yeah, you may be under surveillance. There's <laughs> yeah. a good chance, Elvis. There's uh-huh. <laughs> a good chance, Elvis. <laughs> <laughs> so, what's your question? When was the first alarm clock invented, and at uh-huh. what stage did it become integrated with the radio? The very first, first alarm clock. Uh, well, well there, there have been alarm clocks for as long as there have been clocks. Pretty much as soon as people invented a timepiece, they try to find a way of getting it to wake you up. The earliest mention of alarm clocks, uh, they've to ancient Greece. Nobody's entirely sure what the mechanism was, but it was something to do with dumping pebbles onto a gun. Didn't have to put a battery in or anything. Uh-uh, no, there were no batteries. There were no batteries in those days. Unless you refer to uh, b- batteries of, of troops, which there were. Oh. And I suppose you if mean? you were the emperor of somewhere, then you could at least assign a battery of troops oh. to wake you up in the morning. Oh, yes. Uh-huh, you're, there you you're go. See, it all connects together. It's the holistic approach. Like I say, there was some kind of mechanism for dropping pebbles onto a gun. There's probably a water clock or something. Second half of your question is all going to reach your answer. Uh, the first radio alarm clock was invented in the 1940s by a man named James Reynolds. Uh, they became very popular very quickly. Wow. Well, that's, that's, that's great. I hope that satisfied you, Paul Penny in Bournemouth. Indeed, very much. Thank you very much. Uh, we've got an email.